was a colorful occasion graced by Safaricom CEO Bob Colimo, who was also the chief guest. In his redress, he had a handful piece of advice to the graduates. So you might ask, is life after school really that bad? Now the truth of the matter is that it can be as good or as bad as you want to make it. Now, if you continue to be the happy-go-lucky partying student that many of you have been, then I fear that it might be bad for you. If you continue to disregard the lessons of your lecturers and your professors and family have taught you, then it will be bad. And if you continue going into the world with unrealistic expectations of yourself and of others, then it really will be bad. Now, the second thing that you will require in your life journeys is a sense of humility and respect for yourself and for those around you. Uh, sometimes it's so easy to develop a deep-seated feeling of entitlement and to feel smug about the fact that you are a graduate of such a great university. But what will really get you ahead is practicing the art of humility in everything that you do. From the vice chancellor down to the graduates, it was all smiles depicting a happiest moment since they were all optimistic that the university had provided them with the necessary tools that will help them scale higher heights of success. We celebrate because the, because the multidisciplinary nature of our curriculum that will enable you to bring a broad, critical perspective to bear on the challenges you will encounter in real life. Society rightly demands that you account for the resources that have been invested in you. Society views you as a return on investment. Seeing, you know, the process, the courses and everything, but I'm grateful to be here, to my parents, to my guardians, to everyone, yeah, who has made me reach where I am right now. What's your message that to those who are, who are still behind you? Uh, work hard. It's it's hard, but not impossible. We, I mean, we've gotten here, so why don't you? Why can't you get here? Yeah. I'm um, an IBA student, concentration in finance, and uh, I'm glad. I'm glad uh, I've sailed through this journey for four years, and finally I've made it to this level. My message to upcoming generation: There's nothing impossible in this world. It all starts with a dream. Once you have a dream. Just strive for your goal, then you will achieve it. The event was graced by high-profile personalities who included government officers, businessmen, as well as U.S. members of diplomatic corps. Elsewhere, Kasarani Member of Parliament held a women workshop in his constituency in Kasarani that was meant to sensitize them on reproductive health. And today we are talking here to the women and the youth and opinion leaders of this area uh, on reproductive health and rights. We have also talked to them about the Constitution, what is contained in the Constitution. We have also talked about the national RH policy. We have taught them about Vision 2030, and uh, we have uh, really dwelt on uh, reproductive health and rights. Ongoro also used the opportunity in affirming that she was still in the race for the senatorship seat, adding that she has what it takes to be a senator. If I become the senator of Nairobi, I am thoroughly convinced that I will be the right checkmate for the governor's uh, office and how they expend the, the monies. Kasarani is a cosmopolitan constituency besides having a huge population.